Okay, here we go. We're going to be looking at WordNet today. It allows you to look up definitions of words uh, from the command line. Now, obviously, if you want to get a little more involved, you can write your own script using something like links or curl to grab definitions of words from like Webster or dictionary.com. But uh, WordNet works pretty good and it's simple to use. If it's not installed on your system, just use aptitude or apt-get or whatever your package manager you prefer to install WordNet. Once you run that and type in your password and download install, it's got a lot of features uh, that I'm not even going to touch on today. If we just type in WordNet, you can see a bunch of different features it has here, a bunch of different options. We're going to look at it very simple though. We're going to give it a word. We'll say Linux. We want the definition. We want to know what Linux is. So you say WordNet, the word you want, and then dash over for overview of senses. With enter, it says Linux is a noun, and it says uh, Linux, an open source version of the Unix operating system, which is, yeah, pretty much right. Um, I wouldn't define it like that, but hey, so we'll say cup. It tells you what a cup is. It has three definitions for cup. We can say something like car, and you can see it brings up car, auto, automobile, machine, uh, motor car. It also gives you definitions for car as far as rail car, railway car, railroad car, and so on and so forth. The elevator car, cable car. Uh, let's give it another word. We'll say pen. It says, all right, compose pen. It says, you know, that you'd use it to write, produce literary work. Um, what's another word? Uh, we'll go with mouse. So you can see there it says that the first definition is basically that, you know, it's it's an animal of some sort. Uh, it gives you some uh, verbs to use mouse, but then it also says that mouse uh, manipulates uh, the mouse of the computer. So it basically gives you a little... Uh, definitions. It doesn't doesn't give you the full definition of the word, just a quick description. I'm sure if you look through the other options of WordNet, you can get do a lot of other things. But I just thought that was a simple little command that I learned. Uh, play with it. Maybe you'll learn more. Um, but I just wanted to show you this quick little tip using WordNet to get a brief overview or an overview of senses uh, to uh, find out what a word means from the command line. So I thank you for watching. And I hope that you have a great day. Please visit the links in the description and filmsbychris.com. That's Chris with a K. Thank you for watching.